turkey, then one and a half cups of shredded summer squash, and you want to make sure that they're the larger ones, don't use the really small grater. Then I've got one can of tomato sauce, the 15 ounce can. You're going to want three or four cloves of garlic that are minced up, one carrot that's finely chopped, a half of an onion that's finely chopped, so that'll be about three quarters of a cup. I've got one tablespoon of chili powder, one teaspoon of paprika, one teaspoon of oregano. You're going to want some salt and pepper to taste. And then I recommend adding a little bit of cheddar cheese at the end, but that's just an optional. it on the medium high heat and then all you're going to do is you're just going to want to brown um, either whether you've got the ground beef or the turkey. Once it's brown then all you're going to do is I removed um, some of the extra grease and you're just going to add in your onions and you're going to saute these for about two minutes. next thing we're going to do is we're just going to add in our carrots and then we're going to saute these for about two more minutes. Alright, and as you can see the onions are starting to get a little bit translucent. Your carrots won't be quite soft yet. And then all you're going to do is you're going to add in your squash. We're going to mix this together and then we're going to saute this for one to two minutes. in our tomato sauce. Just make sure that that gets nice and mixed in. Then we're going to add in all of our seasonings. So our chili powder, paprika, Oregano, our garlic, and then you're going to want to do a little salt and pepper to taste. And you're going to mix this all in. You're going to want to reduce your heat down to medium, and then you're going to let this simmer for about 8 to 10 minutes and it'll start to thicken up a little bit. Now that that has reduced down the tomato sauce, um, it's ready to serve. Um, the way that I typically serve it is on hamburger buns. If you want to spice it up a little bit, you can actually um, toast the buns and on the bottom bun just put some um, sharp cheddar or um, medium cheddar and then they're ready to serve. So, hope you enjoy!